Milford, Milford, Milford. Oh, hey, didn't see you there. We're currently uh, running to our boat right now. We just took about an hour and 40 minute drive up here to Milford Sound where we're gonna be doing a two hour boat cruise for about 40 US dollars per person. Yeah, during the two hour drive, it was a beautiful drive. You go through all these mountains, enter into the fjord lands, and um, it's just a great view. We got lucky to uh, kind of see the sunrise as we were going through there. So towards the end here, once we got a little bit closer into Milford Sound, then, uh, yeah, then it got a little bit more cloudy, but some amazing views driving through Milford. One thing to note is that 200 and something days per year it rains here, so expect that it's gonna rain, and if you get any sunlight, then you're just lucky there. We're gonna run over to the boat cruise. Be prepared that parking right near the boat is gonna cost you 30 New Zealand dollars. So that was a bit of a surprise for us. We're probably like six minutes into the walk and we're almost to the port, so make sure you leave enough time to walk from the car park to the, they call it the car park parking lot, to where the boat picks up at the marina. So the cruise we're taking today is with Go Orange. When you arrive here, make sure you stop at the check-in counter first, because they're gonna give you these orange cards, which are in place of your tickets, and then you give those orange cards to be able to board the boat. So, super excited to check out Milford Sound, the famous Milford Sound, so we'll see you on there. Hello. Good morning. All right, guys, luckily we made it up here onto the boat just in time with like five minutes to spare. And uh, the boat we're on here has three different levels. The first two levels are more of a covered area because like I said earlier in the video, here it rains, I think 250 or something days per year. And so far, I think we're getting pretty lucky because it's blue skies with just a few clouds. So it's a perfect time to be up here on the third level, which is a viewing deck where you have all these absolutely insane views of these mountains. If you're anything like us and forgot to grab your morning coffee this morning, good news is on the boat they have coffee and snacks and things like that. And for two pretty large coffees it was only 11 New Zealand, so actually not too expensive. Hopefully you can hear this too, it's uh, starting to get a little bit windy, but the views are unreal. So about 45 minutes into the cruise and for sure top five most beautiful places I have ever seen in my entire life. Like this is just phenomenal and we came like I said, on a perfect day. We just finished up the uh, boat tour here. Unfortunately, both of my battery packs died, so I didn't get to finish filming much more on the boat besides with my GoPro and Osmo, but the tour was amazing. I don't know if we just got very lucky, but we went through most of the whole first hour going to the end of Milford Sound, and we only had just a little bit of clouds, but we didn't have any rain, which was so nice. And then when we came back around, we saw just such amazing views of the clouds, like wrapped around the mountains and we went a little bit further and turned around and all of a sudden there was like this massive rainbow behind us. It was just like absolutely picture perfect. And uh, yeah, shortly after that, then we saw a bunch of sea otters just sitting up on this rock. So it was like just one of the best things I've ever done. Like this was for sure like maybe top five coolest places I've ever been to. And at first I had heard, you know, maybe there's gonna be a lot of tourists and like it was gonna be fully overloaded, but it's so massive that, that you really don't feel how many people are actually there. And uh, luckily with our boat cruise, it just was like just the right amount of people. So there wasn't too many people. We weren't tripping over each other. We weren't like in each other's ways taking photos and videos. So that made it for that much better of an experience because we could really just take in all of these unreal views. We just got back over to the dock here a little bit ago. Looking at all the other tour boats, not having taken any of them, it looks like those ones hold a lot more people and some of the ones we saw boarding seemed like, you know, they might be a little bit more crowded. So we're pretty confident still, even only after trying Go Orange and kind of looking at the other boats, that Go Orange was definitely the best way to do it. And it was a good value for the dollar too. So we really feel like we got to see all of Milford Sound and have such a great time doing it. And so now we're gonna go ahead and check out more of this area. And if you wanna see a bunch more videos like this in New Zealand and other countries, hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, guys, give it a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.